back to Front Seat Driver. My name is Jason. Today's video is being brought to you by ACS Composite. Uh, I had an opportunity to meet with ACS Composite and Corvettes at Carlisle a couple months ago back in Car uh, Carlisle, Pennsylvania, and I was very impressed with uh, the owner and kind of the, you know, his philosophy behind, uh, you know, his company and the quality of their product. And I actually bought a product while I was there. I'm not going to tell you what that is today because I did do a video on it. I just haven't finished doing it but it will be coming out shortly and I'm really excited about that as well. But anyway, they reached out to me a couple, uh, about the end of last week and uh, told me that they were interested in letting me try out their new XL Rock Guards. And I thought that would be pretty cool. I really like what I've seen on it. I've seen it on the, on the website a few times. Some of my friends were looking to buy it and uh, I thought maybe I would as well down the road here. So this is a perfect opportunity for me to be able to put them on, try them out, and let you guys see what it's like. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. We're, let's go do this install. Before we go out and do the install, let's take a quick look at what's inside the box. Instructions, courtesy card, clips. Take them with us. Very nice. These are the XL Rock Guards, and if you, I don't know if you can see it, but it is definitely the carbon flash, and it matches perfectly with the car. And I'm very excited about getting these on. There are two, one for each side, one for the driver side, one for the passenger side. So let's go out and get these on. So we're in the garage now, getting ready to install the ACS Composite XL Rock Guards. The only tool that you need is a 7mm wrench, and I have to tell you, this is one of the easiest mods that you can make. It will be very helpful for your car, but it is absolutely as simple as it could possibly be. So let's get started. The first step in installing the ACS Rock Guards is to remove a screw that's right underneath this area right here. So you can see I've already kind of loosened it to give you an idea of where it is, but it is attached to this little piece right here. Come out and it makes it a lot easier. Once you get that screw out, this thing just basically comes right off. So I brought the car out into the driveway because I felt like there wasn't enough light in the garage. There might have been, but the next step is we're going to take this piece right here off. Just going to pull it, get them little pull pins, pressure pins out. So it's a lot easier with two hands, but I am filming this, so uh, I pulled it out with one hand. But that gives you an idea, and your new pieces are going to line right up in here with each of these slots and slide in on the bottom as well. So just for comparison's sake, you'll see this is the OEM guard, and this one, look how much bigger this is, significantly bigger on the side. So it makes a big difference on catching those rocks that are coming from your wheels. So the next step to installing the XL Rock Guard is to basically have these little pressure pins fit right back in these slots right here. And now all I have to do is install this last screw underneath and we're done. So now we're all done. This is the final product. Like I said, keep in mind that the other you know, guard here. Actually, really, I wouldn't even have called it a guard because really it was only to the edge of the uh, wheel well here. And this one hold, goes out a couple of inches. But it definitely matches perfect with the side skirts. I think it looks fantastic. So ACS did a great job with these. I highly recommend these for your car, especially if you have a C7 with the wide tires that we carry on these. It makes a huge difference. So let me know in the comments what you think about these. I, like I said, I, I'm really pleased with the way they turned out, and I do have another ACS uh, composite component on my car 
that I am not going to reveal just yet today, but I will show you very soon because I'm going to try to finish that video up either today or tomorrow and get that one out as well. Uh, but anyway, hope everybody enjoyed this video. If you have any questions on this product, man, just message me, uh, you know, leave a question down in the comments. I'll be happy to answer it. Anyway, hope everybody has a great day. Thanks for watching.